Psalm 74 Maskil of Azaph O God, why have you cast us off forever? Why does your anger smoke against the sheep of your pasture? Remember your congregation, which you have purchased of old, the rod of your inheritance, which you have redeemed, this Mount Zion, wherein you have dwelled. Lift up your feet unto the perpetual desolations, even all that the enemy has done wickedly in the sanctuary. Your enemies roar in the midst of your congregations. They set up their ensigns for signs. A man was famous according as he had lifted up axes upon the thick trees. But now they break down the carved work thereof at once with axes and hammers. They have cast fire into your sanctuary. They have defiled by casting down the dwelling place of your name to the ground. They said in their hearts, Let us destroy them together. They have burned up all the synagogues of God in the land. We see not our signs. There is no more any prophet, neither is there among us any that knows how long. O God, how long shall the adversary reproach? Shall the enemy blaspheme your name forever? Why do you withdraw your hand, even your right hand? Pluck it out of your bosom. For God is my King of old, working salvation in the midst of the earth. You did divide the sea by your strength. You broke the heads of the dragons in the waters. You broke the heads of Leviathan in pieces and gave him to be food to the people inhabiting the wilderness. You did cleave the fountain in the waters. You dried up mighty rivers. The day is yours. The night also is yours. You have established the light and the sun. You have set all the borders of the earth. You have made summer and winter. Remember this, that the enemy has reproached, O Lord, and that the foolish people have blasphemed your name. O deliver not the soul of your turtledove unto the multitude of the wicked. Forget not the congregation of your poor forever. Have respect unto the covenant. For the dark places of the earth are full of the habitations of cruelty. O let not the oppressed return ashamed. Let the poor and needy praise your name. Arise, O God, plead your own cause. Remember how the foolish man reproaches you daily. Forget not the voice of your enemies. The tumult of those that rise up against you increases continually.